Pisces, March 1st to March 7th tarot card reading. I'm feeling like you may get into some type of a fuss, a situation that may bring out a feeling of anxiety within you. And this may be concerning some women or a woman, a woman or maybe multiple, maybe fans, maybe friends. You were like in some type of a, an, a disagreement and you were worried like maybe someone was saying you were you know doing something that you shouldn't have been doing and then um you had to like calm the situation down so it was like whew, you're, gonna, you're gonna go through one of that in in uh, Mar march 1st to march 7th pisces i'm also seeing real love true love happiness contentment and maybe some type of pregnancy okay Pisces. Well, someone is like a superstar, or you're gonna be working with one. You're making money, and you're getting a lot of attention. And I also see someone's dream house or dream car. You are so loved, Pisces. It's almost like someone from heaven, or the whole space watching over you, or clouds, or something like this. It's so mystical and beautiful right now. Like you are heaven, and this, I don't know. Or someone head in, head in the clothes. But it's like godly. Someone is watching over you. And you are someone's dream person. It's so strange. I feel like, like there's a goddess watch. <laughs> watching over Pisces. Six of diamonds. Someone moving around to you. Three of Wands. Whatever it is though, it's making you happy. You could be a goddess watching over someone. Ten of Diamonds. A lot of money. I hear will, insurance. Wow. This is a lot of wealth. Nine of Swords though. Someone felt lost. Or missing. Moon card. Piscean. Someone is missing you. Someone wants to sleep with you or be with you, be by your side, or just be comfortable with you. Someone is missing you so much, Pisces. Someone is crying over you. Someone is like secretly missing you, crying. It may be the wind, because someone may be cold. Someone may be getting information. Maybe something about a Passover. Yes, you're not talking to someone or someone isn't talking to you right now. And someone is just feeling sad. Someone, but, but the Ten of Diamonds is like, wow. Nine of Cups is like this beautiful dream come true energy. Yes, someone has cut connections. King of Wands. Someone is bitter, upset. Someone is being, um vehement or spiteful okay or they just feel like because they've been affected before you know how if you if you're cruel to an animal it takes it just it's scared of you it retreats and then some some that has happened to someone and now they're in defense protective mode defense mode but there's a person that is upset about that. Someone is upset that another person is like hiding their energy, keeping their energy back from them. Like someone is saying, let me in, let me in. And another person is like, no, not by the hair of my chinny chin chin. Because like you're a wolf and you, I know what you're here for, but the wolf inside is upset. Like this person is like... The um the audacity of you to not want to let me in. I've put in so much work. I've disguised myself so much. Like, uh, so you are smart. Okay, maybe this is someone you recently found out their true colors, and so you're protecting yourself. But you may be very like upset about the truth that you found out. Like that you have to leave something or someone behind. You know. Yeah, the Eight of Cups is next. I do feel someone is coming back. 
I'm getting the energy of a love connection that was somehow lost, but it's gonna this person is gonna come back to you as if they never really left. Cause like they're gonna come back to you because they love you. But maybe they were feeling like they needed time and space for something. Yeah, guilt is the first card. Someone someone felt guilt that flew out of the Oracle deck, Pisces. Someone felt really guilty, nonchalant and bitter. But they're somehow taking some breaths and they feel like coming. They just know that they love you and they'd rather be with you to work things out. So there, this could be about birth, a contract. Someone felt left out. Someone didn't know how, how to feel. Insecurity. Someone felt really triggered, rejection, and rejected. And someone wanted answers. But this someone felt really, like another person felt really upset and like they were done wrong. So they had to preserve themselves. But now both people are upset. But one is more upset than the other, but the other still feel like I'm more I'm I'm more upset than you. So <laughs> it's that energy. But someone is about to break first and move toward like come back, you know, move back. And it's like they left a long time ago. Or the distance. I don't know mysticism someone wants to keep certain things a secret there could have been third party energy exes and lies someone's upset about that someone found out the truth and they got upset someone may have taken money from another person or given money to someone else but someone they cannot do without you pisces they want to come back i'm telling you someone is like Hurrying back that like with with a burning feeling of love inside They feel like they want their good thing back You could be dealing with a Capricorn your soulmate and completion someone is over waiting. They're done waiting That's this is what is happening perseverance. This person is not giving up so uh, March 1st to 7th and there may be a proposal a marriage offer okay okay so take it easy out there and thanks very much for listening pisces hope you find some that can help you on your journey and help you um resonate with you in some way like share comment subscribe all the best and all is within you